Welcome back to Rob Person Pixel. I just stole Oot's Thunder by introducing even though I'm playing, so there. No, the one thing I'm good for. <laughs> Look how many lives I got, dude. Yeah, we got we got a lot of lives. We're expecting to use them. Hopefully not all of them, but it's quite possible. No way. Is this always here? Yes. No, the door wasn't open. Okay. Because this is the sign-up station. Mm-hmm. Conqueror's got to join the army. Oh, God, I remember this part. This is dumb. Well, let's hope it's not too dumb. It's pretty dumb. Suck this dumb. <laughs> Are both pilots sleeping? Yep. Both of them. Yep. And a submarine. With a turret. It's a very cartoony submarine. Looks very Looney Tunes-ish, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. But about, I bet there's about to be some uh, non-Looney no, lon, non Tunes-ish kind of comedy. Yes, yeah, true. People don't usually die in Looney Tunes. They just kind of get squished and then walk away and, as some kind of cartoon pancake. Hey, it's him. Uh, okay. <laughs> How many squirrels are there on this world? I don't know. You know what? I might get in trouble for this. Uh oh. But it might uh give us some, some I don't know. I hate Doctor Who. Uh oh. Uh oh. Shots fired. Like I don't get it. There's no purpose for it right now. It's just like. Just randomly, it's like we're talking to well, the military somebody, guy. Well, somebody was messaging me or something, and then I saw, like, a picture. I'm like, it was Dr. Who. Oh, my God, this is so funny. I'm like, yeah, I don't care about this at all whatsoever. <laughs> this is dumb. It's... <sighs> I don't like, like, crapping on other people's, like, interests No, but, and I mean, stuff. the fact that it's, like... But, no, I know how you feel because my dad and brother watch it all the time, and they're really into it, and every time I go upstairs... And they're like watching an episode or something. I sometimes I stop for a couple minutes and just see what's going on, and I'm like, "Wow, this is really dumb." I know my mom so, and my sister they they spend time watching it. And I'm like, "Why?" I mean, fair enough. I've never given it a solid chance. Like I've never like started at the beginning or anything. But oh so, geez, oh geez, what the crap? Those are Robo landmines. He's gonna come laugh at me. They need to have some electricity put through them. He sounds like he's like American mixed with Australian almost. I don't know. Oh, um I'm I'm gonna accommodate on these graphics again though. This is really good for 64. Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh um, yeah, Doctor Who sucks. Like Doctor Who's lame. The main problem Good I have. God! The main problem I have with Doctor Who really is that like, there seems to be pretty much no semblance of plot. I mean, like there is a plot to it, but like most of it is basically like, it seems like the writers just wrote, "This is sci-fi. The Doctor says it makes sense, so everybody believes it." And it's of like course. he's like, "Oh, don't worry. That's just what the Ziggurdobs of Zugaldoo do," and you're like. Oh, okay, I guess that's just what they do then. Like, it makes sense because he said so. And I'm like, are you kidding? Also, this is ridiculous. Well, like, I don't watch it at all, but apparently he's, like, immortal. Like, when he dies, he just gets, like, yeah, reincarnated or I something. Think, I think that's mainly an excuse to just keep the series going yeah, of and course. keep replacing I, I know, the main actor. I know, but I'm like... And, yeah, th that always never sat well with me either. It seems almost more like a money-grubbing strategy than, like, actual And ending things. it definitively. Yeah, it's just like... Like, one of the, one of the best shows... Mm-hmm. A couple of the best shows I've seen, they just end oh, it yeah. definitively. Yeah, like, no, there is no chance of we've, conclusion. We've had a plenty of uh, conversations about this kind of thing. Like, um, I think Cowboy Bebop yeah. was, was amazing. Like number one on like most everybody's top ten list kind of thing. It, it's, 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 it just ends. It's like, all right, completely. but yeah, like it it ends in a way that like you're like, oh, that's the end, and you had like fun with the adventure and stuff, but yeah. it's over. Um, Samurai Champloo was yeah, the that same was, way. Yeah, same same studio. Um, one of my favorite examples is Death Note. Oh, because, yeah, Because, right? like, 
like a lot of animes uh, that are based off a of manga, right? Like, they're sort of run like uh, like most animes or mangas, right? Are um, essentially like a weekly publication. <laughs> nice. You see that? Yeah, you see so. that? <laughs> so they're a weekly publication. Oh God! <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> Above. Um, so what happens is like things like Naruto and Bleach and stuff tend to run on forever because, because like, they're money. It's like you're published. It's like the the uh, publishers, Shonen Jump or whatever, like keep making more because this is successful and we yeah. don't want to like take a risk on a new series if we can keep selling something we know will work. Um, and so that makes sense from a business perspective. Yeah. But I think it really weakens the story. I know, like... Because with, eventually it just runs on so long, and you're like, well, this isn't really going anywhere. I know, it's with like, Naruto, I was really into it in high school. Uh-huh. And then, like, um, I was like, okay. And then high school ends, and it's still going. Okay, it's gotta be getting close, you know? Mm -hmm. And then, um, like, I'm out of high school, I got a job, I'm working. Like, okay, it's still going. I mean, I'll check it now and then, but... And then it kept going even more, and now I now that it's even ended, I don't even want to check it anymore. I don't want to see how it ended because I got so bored with it. Yeah, but like Death Note is sort of the counterexample because like it was almost like a two part novel in the way it was like just presented. Yeah, and I feel like that worked fairly well. It yeah. could have actually gone without the second half and still been like an incredibly successful series. I think just because like the way it was written was written to like not go on forever. Yeah, I don't know where to go, dude. I don't know where to push this thing. There's, right. no, there's no buttons over there. Then then let's look this up so we don't waste everyone's time. Okay, um, yeah, and let's take a, let's take, a, take a break for a second. We'll just we'll be right back. Oh, welcome back. Mm. All right, I, th I saw I found context sensitive. Let's go check out this context sensitiveness. Let's I'm hope... pretty sure there's a guy taking a dump with diarrhea. Let's hope this is the answer. Why did that? Not... Oh, there he goes. He's just knocking. It's a very wide door. <laughs> You've got a problem. Light a candle. Oh wait, you can't. You're strapped to TNT. I, I, are you the janitor? I, I don't suppose you have any uh, uh, like toilet paper? Ew. <laughs> I'm not the janitor. And could we please have this conversation somewhere else? I, I think I'm starting to gag. Oh uh, yeah. It smell pretty bad. Can you imagine if video games had smell vision? Uh, this game would be awful. People wouldn't play it. This game would be awful. Most games nowadays would be awful. Like, they'd have to stop implementing sewer levels. I, I, I think to have this also, like, <laughs> war games. I mean, that's probably, oh, sure. that's probably gotta have a terrible smell. Yeah. No, I've heard I've heard dead people smell pretty bad. And, um, zombies. Mmm. And, uh, just monsters in general. Space invaders might not smell too bad because it's like in space and space doesn't have smell. Yeah. All right, so I think I gotta. Oh. Oh, that's right. Yeah, this is gonna everyone. suck. Yeah, probably. <laughs> All right. Oh, is that why you need the box yeah. over there? I see. Um. Um. Uh. Yeah, I think okay. you gotta get him through there. Yeah, I do, but I was trying to remember if that box had anything to do with it. Okay, let's uh, wait for this guy, and uh, let's continue our Doctor Who hate discussion. Well, I guess I don't like hating on things that other people enjoy too much. Um, move so it, honestly, stupid face! Move it, move it, move it! Because I feel like it's very safe to say that I just don't get it. You know, maybe there's there's something good about it that I just don't see. I don't know. I don't see it either. But, yeah, it's just, like, oh. saying that, like, something makes sense because the main guy says it does is terrible reasoning and logic to me. I, I, I'm kind of the same and, way with, uh, with, with ponies. Well, sure, but I'm, I just, I just that's don't get like it. an I, eternal mystery. I know, but I, don't, I just don't get it. Oh, you're not going to make it. I'm totally making it. Oh, jeez, you made it. I made it. Holy with crap. time to spare. Yeah, I was... Oh, dude, I rocked that. Yep. Made it in one try. Go ahead and take your dump right there. Or he's just gonna sit and wait. And now I think I got to um, go back and go the other way now. Yeah, probably. I'm not gonna make it. I made it. <laughs> <laughs> um, dude, I gotta go through a freaking minefield, dude. Yep. I don't know how that's gonna work, or he's supposed to. It's going to work terribly. Like, like terribly, 
there's, terrible. There's got to be some other way. Also, there's another guy in there. Is there? Should be. Should be. No, I guess not. You maybe have to blow that guy up first. How? I don't know. Is there like a um, thingy around here? Context sensitive. Some sort of thingy. Let's check right here. Hmm. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I better have had to do like one side first. I don't think so. Even if you did, like, I don't know. Should I go smack him? Um. I mean, you you could. There's got to be some way to set him off at least. I know, but like the only thing I can think of, because I don't got any contact sensitive, is just going up and smacking him with my frying pan. I don't know. But I kind of get the feeling that might hurt me. This is what we get for reading ahead just enough to like... Ow! I was right about it hurting me. Also, it didn't seem to do any good. Why do you dive, Conker, stupid squirrel? Uh-oh, there's bad music playing. Maybe you gotta do something else here first. Great, I can't see anything. No! Hmm. Yeah, I remember this being sucky. Well, I did find contact <coughs> sensitive though. Yep. I, I'm, I'm gonna keep browsing. You, you, uh, you look up in the notebook. Let me see. I'm gonna try pushing back this way now. Uh, but, 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 but. I remember them saying the electricity is out. I gotta do something about the electricity. Uh huh. Let's see. How did they get in there? Another one. <laughs> it really is weird how that bathroom just becomes like a weird like spawning point imp dispenser do I gotta find toilet paper then I gotta take it to the great mighty poo <laughs> uh, let's see all I remember is hating this part I might have blocked it out like in the, uh, the spooky it says something about the stone path used after restoring the re electricity is particularly handy here. Stone path. Um, well, either it's not in the N64 version, or you're already supposed to have the electricity back on. Ah, oh, jeez. Let's see. It says there should be... A lever nearby the ladder. Yeah, that's what I saw in the book. And I was like, oh, okay, and there's nothing there. So I was like, wait, what? Hmm. Oh, and I guess there's like a... A stone path or something between the mines where the mines don't spring up and hit you? I'm not hitting that yet. Yeah, there's no stone path here. Maybe the Xbox version was just made easier. Aw, oh, the Xbox players need help. It's kind of what it seems like here. I, um, I'm wondering what to do with this. I mean, this part is pretty dumb, but, like... This br well, mo oh, quite a few parts of this game have been dumb. Mm -hmm. it's, it's still funny, but... Well, it's, it's like, dumb funny. But, like, what I'm talking about is just, like... This part, you were talking about how this is really annoying. And it's already really annoying. <laughs> I don't remember most of it, but yeah, I remember this part being annoying. Mm-hmm. I'm stuck. There you go. Alright, come on. Pushy, pushy. So, I don't know. It says something about turning the power back on, but... The power thing wasn't there. 
So we may have to. I got the metal box. May have to do something else. Well, I'll figure it out eventually. I mean, I did before. Yeah, but I don't want to spend like, you know, five episodes here. Well, I mean, like I said, I've done it before. Figure it out. It's not gonna be five episodes. Oh. 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 Whoop de whoop de whoop. Whoop de whoop. Ouch. They made it pretty far. You made it about halfway. Okay. Uh, horseshoe, go up. Okay. So I'm good. There's two here, and the horseshoe I move up a little bit. Hmm, okay. Like, you know, I can believe that you do that, it's just I'm not sure what this power thing is. <laughs> since it's, uh... Well, it seems to have been a bit missing from the Xbox One. Because it was all censored and everything. Mm-hmm. Oh, I pushed him back into the toilet. Oops. Yeah, it looks like some of this was made easier. <laughs> Poor Microsoft players. Oh. <laughs> they need it easier. And censored. And censored. Because bad words hurt people's feelings. Ark's joking, by the way. He's an Xbox player. I prefer 64. Yeah, but like... You still played a lot of Xbox 360. Yeah, but I mean, that, that was my, my last-gen system mm -hmm. for... Uh, Peripheral, per preferred. Preferred. That was the word I'm looking for. That was my preferred last gen system. Mm -hmm. oh. 360 was a pretty good system. A little too close again. These spider mines are not very cool. At least I only lost one life there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did play a lot of. Uh... Dude, I landed on him and I died. <laughs> I like tried to jump off him like Mario. Well, when has that ever worked? Uh, Mario? In this game. <clears throat> um, Mario? Pretty sure Mario's never been in this game. Mario? <laughs> oh. Can't just keep saying Mario and expect it to work eventually. Luigi? <laughs> oh. oh, that reminds me. <clears throat> I am. Um, I logged on to my uh, my 360 earlier today mm -hmm. to um, just start up like Netflix or Hulu or something like that. Sure. While I was doing something else on, on my second screen, and um, there is a sponsored content in the bottom right hand corner. You might have seen it before. Mm hmm. And uh, this sponsored content happened to be the Mario oh, right. Mario Brothers Three cartoon. Yep. Did you see that? Yeah, you showed me that. Really? <laughs> Mario being advertised on Xbox. It's kind of delightfully ironic. Oh, so far so good. Can yeah, I remember there being it? another long stretch right here. Oh. Watch out. Crap! Well, at least it didn't get you this time. Okay, um, crap, I fell in the water now. <laughs> We've completely lost our earlier discussion about how things should not go on forever because then they become silly and ridiculous. Nah, well, I think we made our point. Yeah, let's hope so. Let's hope nobody, nobody, like, I, I feel like that's the, that's the problem, right? It's like, there's, there's opinions where it's like, people are like, man, I really hate that thing. And then there's people like, I hate people who hate that thing. It's like, you're allowed to have opinions, guys, like... It's not necessarily that one person's right and one person's wrong. Yeah. So. I mean, if you disagree, go ahead. If you Send us your hate mail. I mean, please By don't. The, as soon as we get hate mail, that means we're legit. <laughs> Anyways. I think we'll pick this up again next time on Operation Pixel. Oh. This episode has gone on really long. And we have not gotten very far. <laughs> oh. So we'll try to work this through between episodes and come back with some progress. Slide down the stupid hill. <laughs>